Aloha boys and girls, my name is Wally Amos and I am Piper Amos's grandfather and she asked me to say a few words to you about my career. Uh, I've had a couple of careers. I had a career in show business. I was an agent at the William Morris office and I was the first agent years ago to book Simon and Garfunkel and Marvin Gaye and the Supremes and many of the rock and roll acts during that time period. And then I left show business and went into the cookie business. <laughs> and it just changed my whole life, you know. I never felt really great when I was in show business. But when I went into the cookie business, my whole attitude about life and about work changed. And I think the key ingredient that caused that change was when I started selling Famous Amos cookies, I was doing something that I loved to do. I love chocolate chip cookies. And so that little twist made all the difference in the world. And the one suggestion that I can give to each of you, when you're looking to find a career, don't look for the thing that will make you the most money or give you the most fame. Look for that thing that will give you the most satisfaction, the most gratitude, uh, the greatest sense of feeling about doing something that you really love to do. Because you're going to have to do it every day. So if you love it, then you give it everything you've got. So I, I, I Famous Amos was, was my life, and I gave it everything I got. Now, along the way, sometimes you make mistakes, and things don't work out the way you think they're going to work out. Well, I gave it everything I got, and Famous Amos became a famous company indeed. And then, because of my not being responsible sometimes, uh, because I didn't always give the best I could, or do the, the best I, I had to give, um, I wound up losing the company. Um, I didn't realize how important other members of my team were. And so after building up this company that became maybe the, the biggest uh, and most popular cookie company ever, surely chocolate chip cookie company ever, um, I wound up losing the company. And it's now owned by Kellogg's and um, I don't receive any money from it, but you know, I'm a better person having developed that company, having created that company, and even having lost that company, because I have a greater sense of what it means to, uh, to be responsible now and to just to do your best, you know, with, with, in, in everything. And the greatest thing I learned about losing famous things is how important it is to be a team player. Because I was famous, famous, I thought I was the cat's meow. I thought I was the top dog. Uh, yeah, there were metaphors, dogs and cats. <laughs> but I discovered that, you know, I couldn't do anything without all the people that were working with me and that were helping me. So it doesn't matter what career you choose, but what matters is to choose a career that you love in a field that you love, that it won't be work that you will look forward to doing it every single day and that you'll be so excited to work with your other team members. The word team says, together everyone achieves more. So you're all terrific, you're all supercalifragilisticexpialidocious and um, you can do and be anything you want to do, anything you want to be. But be yourself, uh, be excited about life, be positive, uh, live with integrity, and, and just learn. Learn from your mistakes, and then you're constantly moving up to higher ground. So have a great life. Have a life that not only serves you, but serves your community, and that enriches the lives of other people also. I love you. Piper! <laughs> Piper, thank you so much for asking me to do this video. I look forward to visiting LA and coming to your school 
and seeing all your fellow students in person. And I'm going to give you some cookies from my new company. I'm still selling cookies, Piper. Um, I got a new company and I call it Weymouth Cookies. This is my logo, Weymouth Cookies. We make chocolate chip, chocolate chip pecan, and butterscotch chip cookies. And they're all handmade, just like they were when I started Famous Sandwich. So I'm going to send a package of cookies to your classmates uh, and you, and you guys will share them and you'll have good cookies and you'll enjoy them. And um, I thank you very much, Piper. It was so great to get your text. Um, it's the first text. I should save that text from you forever because that's the first text I got from my granddaughter. I love you, Piper. I love you, boys and girls. Choose to have a great life and have fun above all else. <laughs>